Cyclists gathered at the Canaan Valley Golf Resort today for the first series of the West Virginia Fat Bike Racing. Heather Hale has the story. The recent snowfall has created perfect conditions here for the first of three West Virginia fat biking races here at Canaan Valley. When there's snow on the ground and trail riding on a regular bike isn't an option, fat tire bikes allow the winter loving adventurer a way to enjoy the outdoors. I just like to be outside and uh, the the fat tire bikes let us uh, get outside in, in conditions that we otherwise couldn't ride in. A regular bike wouldn't go over the snow like these do. Groups of people gather to race fat bikes every winter, but only if the conditions are right. According to the West Virginia Fat Bike Race Director Zach Adams, conditions for the race at Canaan Valley couldn't have been better. To me, the real magic with fat biking happens in the winter wonderland with all the sounds of the squeaking snow and the, the frost on the trees. And it's just another really great way to get out in the winter. People traveled from Virginia, Maryland, and Pennsylvania for the fat bike race at Canaan Valley. One lap for this race is about five miles, and cross-country racers did three laps, while double XC racers did four laps. The winter magic will continue as the race at Canaan Valley was the first in the series of three West Virginia fat biking races. The biggest race will be at Whitegrass at the end of February. The next West Virginia fat biking race will take place at Spruce Knob on February 5th and 6th. Reporting from Canaan Valley for 12 News, I'm Heather Hale.